Here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa, watch Roger go insane! <laughs> hey, I'm Raj, and these are my vlogs. It's now past October 31st, and do you know what that means? <laughs> that means it's time to prep for a little thing called Christmas! Along with being a full-time Nancy, who kind of looks like Owen Wilson and Aaron Carter got together to discuss why Aaron decided to do Graham's Dog Grammys after really hitting it off after a little bit of no shame propane and then decided to pull a junior. That can be a bit of a yes, Sergeant yes. Santa. Uh, do you guys remember when Arnold Schwarzenegger decided to do that movie where he gets impregnated and Danny DeVito helps him along the way? If he saw how Mr. DeVito treated his daughter Matilda, he would have been like, I'm not taking advice from you, get to the turkey. You're heading for the turkey, young lady. I kind of sound like Dexter from Dexter's Lab, actually, more than a, a Schwarzenegger. Anyways, the clock is 12 a.m. November 1st, and I grow a big pair of snowballs. I call up all the department stores to make sure that they are all set for the two-month Christmas pre-chorus, or I'll become the holiday version of Negan, and I'll come deck their halls myself. You know, for a Christmas video, I really shouldn't have worn a Negan t-shirt. I don't know if he's as holiday-oriented. I like the Christmas season, and usually that encompasses family. So my family, along with myself, hopped into the truck and headed down to where the holidays were. And the first Christmas event on the docket this year was the 19th annual Kawartha Lakes Festival of Trees at the Kawartha Settlers Village out in Bob Cage. And let it be said that Pioneer Villages are one of the best places you could have a holiday event. First off, the whole village smells like fireplace. Really sets the tone. Second off, there are horse-drawn carriages. <laughs> Because Christmas isn't about cars, the price is right is. The following are acceptable modes of travel for Christmas. Toboggans, the aforementioned horse-drawn carriages, and flying reindeer. But if you're doing any night traveling, be sure to upgrade to the Rudolph model. He comes with high beams. And third off, Pioneer Villages have the best Christmas architecture. Wood cabins everywhere, general stores, churches. They all look so great on the outside, but you know what really matters? is what's on the inside. Except the last cabin we went into. When we went inside, there was a raccoon that stole some kid's peanut butter and the kids started, uh, freaking out. <laughs> now, as the name implies, this was a festival of trees. So, the main attraction is that local businesses and organizations all decorate a tree however they want. Some are traditional, some are unexpected, like the Crayola tree, which has Crayola products as ornaments. And then they set a ticket bucket beside their tree. So, when people come to the festival, they're able to buy tickets they can put their contact info on, and then put them in the bucket beside the tree they want to win, and hopefully they end up with an extra Christmas present. Last year, that's how I got the tree that I have. Christmas trees with joy below. Bless the little heart. So this year we went on the last day of the festival, and when we went to go buy tickets to put in the tree raffles, uh, apparently they were also there. Mother was not happy. They ran out of tickets. So she was steamed about that. I said some things that may not be appropriate for the setting. How do you feel about today's festivities? <laughs> so, how did this issue come to be solved? Well, Santa was busy, so we couldn't ask him, so we had to go with plan B. Retail therapy! So then we went to the local shops Bob Cajun had to offer and looked for things to add to our Christmas list. So that's what happened when we decided to go to the <laughs> Festival of Trees. Wherever you guys are from, is there any cool local Christmas activities to do where you are? Uh, what are your traditions? Hit like, leave a comment, hit the subscribe button. Yeah. Merry Christmas!